Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for clicking on this video to watch it. My name is Odera Okafo and today I have this simple makeup look for you guys. It's pretty much something very easy and simple you could you know wear it to the mall and shop and go for shopping or you know visit a friend and still look cute and nice and pretty so yeah that was the idea behind this look it's very similar to my everyday makeup look it's just that I have eyeshadows on so I took that extra effort to put on some eyeshadows and I like this look a lot so yeah I feel like I look bloated I don't know <laughs> how was your Thanksgiving mine was good i pretty much spent the entire day cooking and at the end of the day i was so tired i didn't have the appetite anymore to eat any of my food i don't know if that happens to you like when you cook and cook and at the end of the day you don't have enough appetite to eat your own food and enjoy it yeah that was what happened to me on thanksgiving but how was yours i'd like to know leave a comment in the comment section and tell me how you um how you spent your thanksgiving um, yeah, but back to this look. If you do want to know how I got this makeup look, keep on watching, don't go anywhere. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit that subscribe button, and give this video a big thumbs up, a big thumbs up, big thumbs up. Give this video a big thumbs up, and leave a comment, as always, I would like to know what you think about this look, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching, bye! Hi guys! So I'm using this eyeshadow from this e.l.f. eyeshadow palette and I'm putting that color on my crease and extending it above. If you guys are wondering why my eyes are white, um, it's because I used my NYX HD concealer to clean my eyebrows after I did my eyebrows. And yeah. So next I'm going to use this eyeshadow palette from Smashbox and I'm going to use this color because I wasn't sure which color was going to fit the entire eyeshadow look or eyeshadow process so I was just playing around with um, eyeshadows and trying to figure out which one will fit best anyways yeah I used the color and I'm putting it on my crease the same place I put the other elf eyeshadow color so now I'm going to use the darker shade from the Smashbox eyeshadow palette and I'm going to put that on my crease and I'm using this elf brush I think it's the eyeshadow brush from Elf to put on my eyeshadows. Next, I'm going to use this Elf blending brush to blend the eyeshadows and just make everything look seamless. So now I'm going to use my e.l.f. blush palette and I'm going to take that pink blusher and put that all over my crease. The reason for this is because I don't have a pink eyeshadow here at home so I'm just going to make use of what I have. <laughs> So I'm just tapping the pink blush on my eyelids and you just keep applying more until you like the way it looks. So now I'm going to use the e.l.f. blending brush and just blend out all the colors. Um, at first I was using a blending brush on its own but it wasn't working because it was just I felt it was cleaning off the eyeshadow so I decided to dip it into the pink blush and blend with that so it's basically blending the pink and the brown dark brown eyeshadows together and it just looks very pretty and effortless so now I'm just going to use this elf bronzer and put that all over my eyelid initially I wanted to just put it in the inner corners of my eyes and leave it there but then I was like hey what will it look like if it's all over your lid Apparently, it covered the entire pink um, eyeshadow and I was like, mm -mm, I want my pink eyeshadow back. <laughs> but um, yeah, anyways, um, I'm just putting the bronzer all over my eyelids and now I'm blending it with the e.l.f. blending brush. So now I'm just going back in with the pink blush and just putting that all over my lid uh, and just try to bring back the pink color. 
um, to my lid so yeah I'll keep putting that in until I'm happy with what it looks like and then I'm just going to dip the brush back into the bronzer and put that just at the inner corners of my eyes of my eyelids and that's what you see me doing and I think I like the way it came out and now I'm going to blend some more just to make everything look seamless of course So now I'm using my NYX liquid eyeliner to do my eyeline. Um, if, you, if you're using a liquid eyeliner with a very thin tip, be careful, be very careful. You don't make mistakes like me. I do make a lot of mistakes, on, especially in my left eyes. I do. Look at it. Look at what I did here. And I was like, how do I get this off? How do I clean it off? But then I went back in with the pink eyeshadow and I just packed that on there until I covered it up and I blended it out and drew my eyeliner again and it looked seamless, it looked brand new. So here I'm using my um, Bobbi Brown foundation stick in Almond 7 and then I'm going to blend it out with my e.l.f. powder brush until you know, you know the deal. Is it blending it out or blending it in? Oh, I don't know the terms, but it's okay. You guys know what I mean. <laughs> so now I'm going to use this e.l.f. lip definer. It has two sides, but I'm showing you guys the side that comes with the shimmer. Um, I wish I showed you guys the other end. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm really sorry about that. Um, yeah, but I'm going to put the shimmer side below my waterline, and I'm going to use this e.l.f. white eyeliner and put that on top of the shimmer just to brighten my eyes up I didn't feel like using a black eyeliner today and now I'm going to use my Smashbox mascara and um, do my lashes so I'm putting that below my lashes uh, my sorry my lower lashes and my top lashes Now I'm going back in with my e.l.f. blush palette and I'm using the pink shade. I pointed out the wrong color, I'm sorry. But I'm using the pink shade, you know the one I used as the eyeshadow, that's the one I'm using as the blush. So now I'm going to use my e.l.f. bronzer and I'm going to use the bronzer as a highlighter. So I'm just putting that um, at the top of my cheekbones and the tip of my nose. Because I didn't want to do so much. This look is just a simple makeup look. So I just didn't want to do so much. Next, I'm going to use Vaseline on my lips. So this is a small carry-on Vaseline I bought a while ago. I think it's from CVS. Um, so I'm just going to use that all over my lips. The thing with Vaseline is that it helps exfoliate my lips. It makes all the dead skins easy to remove. Vaseline is my go-to lip gloss. Like, no lie. <laughs> So yeah, it looks pretty, but I didn't like how it looked with the eyeshadow. So I went back in with my e.l.f. brow um, pencil and I put that all over my lip. And yeah, I like this one better. It matches the eyeshadows and yeah, this is the finished look guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!